The new version of Simple Rockets for PC has a new utility app that I made called Simple Modder. And you can find it under Jundru and Simple Modder. And this utility is going to let you make mods really easily for Simple Rockets. So let me walk through how to add Haley's Comet. Click on the button on the bottom left, it says Create New Mod, and call it Haley. Enter, and then these are all the files that are in Simple Rockets, and we can pick any file that we want to mod. All I want to change is smaller system.xml, so I'm clicking on this. You can see this file over here. It's read-only right now. I can't change it until I click Include in Mod here. And now I can make some changes, and I have... I've already created the planet. I'm just going to paste it in here as the first planet. And save it. And then all you have to do to try your mod is click play. And it's going to launch Simple Rockets with the new mod you're working on. If you scroll down here to the bottom, another feature I added is this button. Whenever it detects that you have mods available, you can click on this. And you can see the list of mods you have. And you can turn them on and off. If you do change, you can only run one mod at a time. And if you change your mod, you have to restart Simple Rockets. So let's go here to the smaller system, and it's the first planet. There it is, Halley's Comet. Go ahead and launch from it. I have a really small rocket. The, the comet is incredibly small, so this is plenty to get around. And here you go. And if I zoom out, you can see just how tiny it is. It's really, really small. So there you go. It's um, it's a really small planet, so if I go to map view here and zoom out, I'm only going 45 meters per second, but I've already, uh, I'm already on course to escape the SOI. Let me zoom out farther here, make a look at this, the orbit for Halley's Comet, and it's really, it's very elliptical. So when you are finished with your mod and you want to share it with somebody else, you can click here on the top right, and there's a package button up here. This lets you save your mod as an SR mod file, which is really just a zip file. Um, and it's going to have all the files in your mod compressed into one file. And I'm just going to call this Haley. Save that. And then it, it does some checks to make sure your mod is okay, make sure that your XML looks okay. So you can close this. So I'm going to go look at that SR mod file under documents. And here it is. You can double click on it to launch Simple Rockets and load that mod file. So this makes it really easy to send this file to somebody else um, and then they can easily you know just double click it and run Simple Rockets and see you know what you put together. So that's it. I hope you guys enjoy Simple Modder and I really can't wait to see what you guys put together. Thanks for watching.